Summertime is here and it's so much fun, but it's important to remember that we need to keep our kids safe as we're enjoying the beautiful weather. Hi, I'm Care, a registered midwife, CPR and safety instructor, and mom of four. I get tons of questions about how to keep kids safe in the summer, and so I'm very excited to partner with the St. Joe's Just for Kids Clinic to bring you three summer safety essentials every parent needs to know. Join me for tips and tricks on how to keep our family hydrated this summer, learn about proper helmet safety for the whole family, and learn how to prevent one of the most common serious playground injuries in toddlers. But remember that if an accident happens, the incredible team of pediatric healthcare professionals at the Just for Kids Clinic is here for our West End families. When heading out on summer adventures with our family, please keep in mind that our little ones can dehydrate and overheat a lot faster than we can. They've got far less liquids in their body and have a hard time cooling off once they have heated up. So please make sure that we've got all of our gear ready and keep some of these tips and tricks in mind when you're heading out. Sunburns can cause dehydration, so always apply a broad spectrum sunscreen with a minimum SPF 30 to all exposed skin before heading out. Sunscreen is not recommended for infants under six months, so please keep them well protected from the sun. If you're baby wearing, try to choose a carrier made of lightweight, breathable fabric to allow for airflow. When using your stroller on hot days, always skip the plastic rain cover and instead use the sunshade and extended UV canopy. If your stroller does not offer adequate sun coverage, a UV protective mesh cover that doesn't impact airflow is a great option. It's important that you never fully cover your stroller, even with lightweight blanket, as it can reach dangerous temperatures very quickly. Never leave a baby, child, or pet in a parked car, even for a moment. It can reach life-threatening temperatures within minutes, even with the windows cracked. When out with your family, make sure to take proper water breaks. When kids are having a blast, they can forget to drink enough. Using a fun water bottle often helps. Water breaks are a great time to reapply sunscreen too. Flavoring water with fresh fruit can be a fun way to get kids more excited about staying hydrated. Plus, make sure to serve foods high in water content like cantaloupe, watermelon, and cucumber. Staying in the shade, playing outdoors at the coolest times of the day, and using sprinklers and water tables are a few more great ways to stay cool this summer. Summer's a great time to head out for a bike ride with the family, but since head traumas are a major cause of possible admission for our children, it's important that we try to prevent these. The best way to prevent these types of major head injuries is to make sure everyone is wearing an appropriate helmet while riding bikes, scooters, skateboards, and rollerblades. Make sure to check the fit each time. Simply put on the helmet and make sure it sits snug, just two fingers above the eyebrows, has the straps in a V-shape around the ears, and has a snug chin strap. After checking our child's helmet, it's essential to model safe behavior and make sure that we're wearing our helmets properly too. The playground is a great place to head with our family during the summer months. Outdoor play has been shown to help our children with their physical, emotional, and mental well-being. But make sure that we remember that our playgrounds can pose risks for our kids. So let's make sure that we prevent those serious injuries like our fractures and head traumas. Choose a properly maintained playground that is appropriate for your child's size and development. Make sure it has a soft surface underneath to cushion any falls. Always stay close to the play structure so you're ready to assist your child if they need you. Teach kids to use the slide properly, one at a time, in a proper seated position. Many parents are surprised to learn that adults should avoid going down the slide with kids on their laps, as it's a major cause of lower leg fractures in toddlers. I hope these three summer safety essentials help keep you and your family safe this summer. But please know that even when we do our best, accidents happen and kids get sick. That's why it's so important to know about the incredible services offered right here in the West End at the St. Joe's Just for Kids Clinic, Toronto's first and only pediatric walk-in clinic in a hospital setting. Their dedicated team of pediatric healthcare providers are here for families when they need it most. So head online to social media and follow St. Joe's Toronto to find out more about the incredible healthcare services available to your family, as well as to find out more about the hospital and the foundation so we can help St. Joe's keep their promise to continue to provide the best healthcare possible to families in our West End community.